were three singer-songwriters that just decided to get together and sing together. A friend of ours who owned a guitar shop, he decided to, you know, put on a show for us. He thought that we were going to be a band, he just had a feeling. But that wasn't the intention, it was just to sing together, and we just started getting offers to play. And then it just snowballed and snowballed and started getting offers across the country. When I hear the trumpets for another member and our mutual friend Aoife O'Donovan uh, recommended me and so I met up with them. They were playing at the World Cafe in Philadelphia and um, I auditioned for them in the handicapped bathroom <laughs> and yeah, it was faded that moment. We were all standing around the toilet. And it was really, yeah. We wanted to mark our 15th year as a band. We wanted to celebrate it somehow, and it had been a while since we'd released a record, and we wanted to do something for our fans who've been um, very loyal and who'd been asking, actually, for, for some of the covers that we'd been playing to be recorded. I was pregnant at the time, and um, we didn't have a lot of time. Uh, we're all moms now, 
um, we didn't have a lot of time to record, so we thought that would be kind of a, um, an achievable thing for us to go into the studio for five days, which is all we had, and, and record um, a bunch of songs that we love and that we've been, we've been playing. So We all went through a period um, of not writing and uh, just focusing on um, child, our children because you kind of have to, you can't. <laughs> <laughs> there's no, there's no uh, medium way of doing that. You have to, you have to pull your, put your all in it for the <clears throat> first while and then, you, and then you can find some time and have some space. Subscribe to War Memorial's YouTube channel to watch new attic sessions being released every month. Thanks for watching.